Hi, I'm Ben. I'm one of the Youth Sport Trust Mental Wellbeing Ambassadors and founder of both the 401 Challenge and 401 Foundation. World Mental Health Day is a day to focus on the amazing work so many organisations are doing to help people that suffer from mental health issues. I spent most of my adult life suffering from mental health issues brought on by my experiences of bullying as a child. With my confidence and self-esteem at rock bottom, I felt obliged to lead a life that others wanted for me, rather than the one I wanted for myself. Constantly feeling anxious, scared and on edge, living on my nerves every day, it felt like there was no way out. Suffering a life-changing moment at 29, a year later, I was introduced to running through a friend. Finding a community that didn't judge me, but supported me, didn't laugh at me, but encouraged me, didn't put me down but told me I could, meant I found joy in my life for the first time in 20 years. Achieving things I never believed were possible meant that my confidence and self-esteem grew, and I finally plucked up the courage to talk to a professional about what happened to me as a child. Without sport, I wouldn't be here. Without sport, I wouldn't have found my place. Without sport, I wouldn't have found, dare I say, my happy. On World Mental Health Day, I think it's vital we talk about the role that exercise and being active can play towards good mental well-being. It's part of my everyday life now. Even though I still don't class myself as sporty, I use sport and exercise as a way to treat my body and mind. The feeling I get when I come out of the gym, finish a run or a bike ride, it's my time away from the stressful bits of life. It's my time to think, my time to recenter my brain, my fighting time. Without exercise, and being active, I literally wouldn't be able to do the things I choose to do in my life right now. It basically helps me live. Working alongside the Youth Sport Trust as one of their proud mental wellbeing ambassadors, I want young people to have the courage to follow their own path in life. It may seem easier at the time to follow what others may want you to do, but in the long run, you may find yourself at a crossroads wondering how you got there. It takes confidence to believe in who you are, you don't need to have it all figured out. Just have courage in your own convictions and you'll ultimately give yourself the freedom to find your happy in life. That's the ultimate goal. It just took me a little while to figure that out. Have a great day.